Hi, Mike Kong here. I'm here at Robo Toy Fest 2014 with the lovely and beautiful, talented Reba West and Tony Oliver, writer, actor, and director, and producer. Whatever pays the bills. Yeah, absolutely, <laughs> yes, yes. My biggest takeaway from your career was Rick Hunter because oh, well, that's, that's your first in, in, uh, uh, role in voice acting, correct? Certainly the most enduring, yeah. <laughs> yeah so. how, how was that experience for you? Well, I was a brand new actor, so I literally was terrified the entire time I was doing it. I was, uh, I was honestly just thrilled to have a gig. And, and anime was nothing back then. No, they called it Japanimation yeah. mostly back then. <laughs> no. Yeah, and uh, and to be working on something that was that after a few weeks of work started to realize this is different, this is special. Mm -hmm. So that was that was fun. But I was mostly just hoping to God not to get fired. <laughs> <laughs> how, can, how can they get rid of Rick Hunter? Well, because if I wasn't acting well, then they would have to, wouldn't they? <laughs> Oh yeah, absolutely. and uh, a Max Million got a higher kill streak. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, how about uh, the Power Rangers series? How do you? How did that take? A, how did your experience go with that? Well, it's a completely different experience. I was mm -hmm. there. I was helping create the show. I wrote the original episode, so the uh, it was blank page writing, which I'd never done before. That's right, that's right. And um, it was. You didn't uh, need the American adaptations to the show, right? Well, yeah, it's more than an adaptation. It's a completely different show than what was in Japan. So yeah, we uh, I did the I was the head writer. I, I had a team of writers, and I helped co-produce the show. And um, it was it was great. I mean, we were once again venturing into into areas that we hadn't ventured into before. So much like Robotech was kind of a very new thing for us. Power Rangers was a new way of making a show. Uh, oh, yeah, and we were, I was I've just been really lucky I got to be involved in two of those in my career. Yes, yes, you know? absolutely. Yeah, we feel privileged as fans that you were involved as well. Well, thanks. <laughs> so out of all of the roles that you've been that you've done, what was your favorite voice acting role? Um, I'd have to say Min May, probably Min of all. I mean, I've done a lot of them. I, I loved um, doing Metropolis mm -hmm. also, yes, which was yes, a beautiful yes. film. Yeah. yeah, I think I love Min May because the, the series is just continued to be popular yes and, yes um, and she, she's still she's still idol you know she's still the, one of the greatest idols in all of the macro series right and also it's it, i think it really brought back um the anime into the united states it was really the kind of um yeah, yeah. Uh, the reason that it came yeah. back because i mean when i i grew up um there was two and two that i remember there was kimba the white lion mm -hmm. And Speed Racer and Clutch Cargo, I guess. Oh my! <laughs> oh my! Gigantor, yeah. Um, and then you know, it, it, they kind of went away for a while, and then after Robotech came in, it came, mm -hmm. it all came in and swarmed for about 30 years, I think, Absolutely. at least. You know, Absolutely. more than that. Good. Have you ever heard of uh, Macross World? Macross World. Macross World. I've heard of it. Yes. Yeah, it's in LA. We have, uh, we had, they had. Um, the art, the, the, art, the artist for the tech, the tech mecha, mm -hmm. and the Lemon May, the <laughs> Japanese Lemon May was there. Oh, so yeah. that would've been wonderful if you would stand next to her. Oh, well, I've, I've been next to her actually, and I was at a convention, and we were both sitting together, signing yeah. autographs that's, together. That's great. This <laughs> duality of the the series. Right yeah, there. she's cuter, yeah. but oh well. So, any suggestions you might have for Robo Toy Fest to be better next year? I don't know. It seems pretty good right now. More, more, more of YouTube. Seems more busy. of YouTube. More, more <laughs> yeah. of YouTube. Absolutely. Well, <laughs> thanks again for watching that hashtag show. We're here with Tony Oliver and the beautiful and talented Reba West. <laughs>